it's just sad to see because he, he puts so much into making sure he's prepared to play every single night. We've talked about what he's done to keep his knees feeling good and everything that goes into him being a pro performer and a, and a key contributor to this team. They were kind of picking up full court there, brought some pressure, but once you beat it, now you have an open court for Kaminga. That's great for the Warriors. Scotty Barnes is a budding superstar. Clay played him very well, and it's Warrior ball out of bounds, but... Okay. Beautiful look by Barnes, who's an excellent defender, coming up with that steal. Warriors are a little flat right now. Barrett missing, and Hurdle. It's having one guy drive and one guy cut off of it, or one guy post up, the other guy cut, and vice versa. There's a lot of different opportunities that can come about, a lot of potential. Quickly bottoming a three. Nice find from Clay Thompson. And Clay could be a playmaker, especially when the defense sells out to his three ball. You just got to look at how big Barnes is. He just ran and sealed Steph. But he rattles it home. That curl is there. His defender was on his back. Like the patience took his time. Another post up. Yeah. What do you think about today's NBA versus when you played and your coaching career with the, the Rockets? How do you like it? Hey, it, it's great. It's fun. Uh, the game is fun to watch. It's exciting. And, and the guys got it done. And that's why I was so proud of that group. So, because they came to work every day. Uh, they came to work every day. And they know. Miami got to the finals as a seven seed a year ago. That doesn't happen very often. Well, we, we knew we had the group to get it done. And, and these guys have been through so many. Early post-ups, Kaminga played Siakam very well there. You, you feel the Warriors' intensity has gone up a little bit now. And Scotty Barnes fouling Kaminga. Quickly with the shot clock at 10. Quickly to Scotty Barnes, just to dunk it down. It, Siakam had nowhere to go. And back out to quickly for three. Scotty Barnes with the rebound. RJ Barrett, how hot am I? I'm not hot. Steph putting it up and out. The Raptors aren't stopping at 70. Oh, finally missed a dunk. And think about this Toronto team. Fred Van Vliet left and went to Houston as a free agent. Look at Clay Thompson and RJ Barrett kind of, like I said, win the half. First of all, win this third quarter. Scotty Barnes missing that three. They're trying to get back to that elite defensive level. Scotty Barnes, we, we like the defense, we like the size. We threw that one away. Look at RJ Bear in the post against Steph. Siakam, back out to Scotty Barnes. We talked about his improved three point shooting, but he missed that. Shot. Good attack and transition. That favors the Warriors, too. Siakam inside. He will put it up and in. So good action. Yeah, that's that Utah. Scotty Barnes got a walk play down. Trace Jackson Davis another rebound. Shooting is perked up for the Warriors, but on this end, can he slow Toronto down? And Kaminga got beat, but then saved the day with a steal. Credit the Raptors, they were brilliant tonight. Shot it at 58.5% for the game. Made 15 threes. They had eight players in double figures against Sack. They put six players in double figures tonight. RJ Barrett was fantastic.